Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And we have, of course, today, Patch Tuesday, that um, has a lot of fixes for security flaws within Windows and different products. But one that is interesting is a zero-day exploited in the wild. So um, this one, of course, is a zero-day that is um, apparently quite um really um, expanded across the planet and is quite uh, popular in attacks and so uh which is interesting is that first of all this is why you should go into windows update and make sure you update your systems today um but one of the things that is interesting too is that um windows 11 24 h2 even though it has the flaw there's a difference in the uh, system that makes it not uh, possible to exploit as easily the flaw. So that flaw has to do with the Windows Common Log File System. And what happens is that they gain access to the system privileges and do what they want. And basically that attack has been going on for a while. And it is, like I said, quite uh, popular. It is uh, everywhere. So Microsoft even jumped in today and said, look, do apply your Windows updates on Windows 10, 11 to make sure you stay safe. Basically, people that get um, attacked will uh, eventually get a message that'll pop up. that will be like this. It says, well, your data has been encrypted. Do not shut down the machine to avoid decryption issues not try to modify anything and so on and it tells you to use the Thor browser because it wants you to go on the dark web and follow a link on the dark web which seems to be some kind of a chat and uh, it of course also tells you do not share this link so uh, basically um, it is an ongoing uh, problem and of course today it is fixed so it's kind of interesting that they ask people to go to the you know, dark web on a Tor browser and so on, uh, where they will probably ask you for some money to uh, fix the exploit. Uh, but it's apparently very easy to uh, go through. Once again, for those that think antivirus is helping you, for flaws like these, zero days, antivirus is totally useless. You're not protected. This goes way beyond any protection you have. That's why the first rule is always to update, to make sure the security flaws are fixed. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.